Hey folks, this is Daryl here with your next edition of Gospel Bites. Gospel Bites are short little videos with uh, messages to help you understand how to better, more effectively share the gospel and have gospel conversations. And I'm <clears throat> wanting to talk to you today a little bit about how to engage your community. That's one of the difficult things that a lot of churches struggle with is how do we engage our community? We live in a time where we can't just expect people to show up at our front doors of our churches. We have to go out and reach those people. Now, ideally, as believers, as disciples of Jesus Christ, we ought to be building relationships with our neighbors and friends and sharing the gospel with them. That should be our first effort to reach out. But unfortunately, so many believers don't see a vision for that. So what I've understood is to help those believers get a vision for their community, it's important to engage the community with the gospel and to get your people outside of the four walls of the church. One of the ways of doing that is to uh, go to community events and have outreaches at those community events. Uh, the church where we're attending right now, Central Baptist, in October will be setting up two booths at uh, the Wendell Harvest Festival, and uh, we will be sharing the gospel there. Faith Riders, which is a motorcycle ministry, they will be sharing uh, three-minute testimonies. Our youth group will be sharing, and we'll be out meeting people in the community. There's other ways of doing uh, outreach in a community, engaging your community. One of the things that I've done effectively in the past is had uh, outreaches during the different seasonal parades, particularly the Christmas parade. It's always a good time to reach out into the community. One of the things that I led our previous church to do was to get out in the community and give away these candy cane cards. And the candy cane cards uh, had the gospel according to the candy cane. Uh, you take traditional striped candy canes and you talk about the stripes on there to relate it back to how Jesus was crucified. And uh, it was well received in the community. Uh, we would easily give out a thousand of those at our local Christmas parade each year. And it always had a candy cane attached to it uh, to go with the card. So think about some of the different uh, outreach events that you can do in the community, not necessarily something that you as a church put on, but going to these community events, whether it be a, a food truck rally or whether it be, um, you know, Christmas parade, uh, and, and get outside of the four walls and engage the community. I think many times Christians just need to have that extra push uh, to be a part of that. And so, plan for some of these events as they're coming up and raise the level of awareness of what your church is doing in the community. Thanks for listening today and I hope you have a great day. Please, uh, if you enjoy the videos, like, and comment, subscribe, and share them with others. Thanks and God bless.